How you doing? Hank Hayes, NLB Tactical. Today we're going to be training and doing a drill for vehicle operations. So what do I mean by vehicle operations? <sighs> vehicle ambush and vehicle bailouts. We're going to do some drills shooting on our targets. We're going to do reload and we're going to do multiple position and cover and concealment. There's a lot going on here. This is an advanced drill, and we're gonna call it non-complex. Why are we gonna call it non-complex? Because we are, do not have moving bad guys. That would then put it in the category of a, not a flat range drill. Uh, this, is, this is definitely um, a drill that's gonna push the paces though. All right, so let's first talk about if you're in a vehicle and you get into an ambush situation, the first thing I would want to do is continue to drive or to drive away or to drive over them or through them. Do whatever you have to do because you have a 5,000 pound vehicle and they are on foot. This particular drill is if we were pinned down and you can't drive out, all right? In this, again, this is a drill. I would then shoot, move, and communicate, or think about pulling your security and mobility, and then a low silhouette when you're shooting. Again, this is from an eight hour day long course. So we're just pulling pieces just to have a teaser and show you some of the things that are available. You want to get off of that ambush X. All right, if we were gonna do the vehicle bailout, obviously our bad guys are here. And so this is the dirty side of the vehicle. This would be the clean side of the vehicle. If we had people in the car, we would instruct them to be getting out of the vehicle on that side while we suppressed fire on our bad guys here. I think that pretty much covers it before we go live. Let's go with eyes and ears. If I didn't mention, I'm running what I run in my concealed life, which is my Smith & Wesson M&P 9C. I wear an appendix carry. So we're gonna have to clear the seatbelt, clear my garment, access my weapon, engage my bad guys, get out of the vehicle. We're not gonna be shooting through the windshield or the driver's side window. If you needed to do that, you can do that, but you have to also recognize that that is gonna change the path of the bullet when you go through glass. These aren't really far shots, but that is a consideration that you have to add in. We are ready to go hot. We make ready. Weapons hot, press check. We're ready to do this drill. Seatbelt on. Ambush, ambush, ambush. Out. So, whew. if I was in my civilian life, sometimes I carry an extra clip with me, sometimes I don't. Your accuracy on your shots absolutely count. That's a great drill.
Again, it's an advanced drill. Why isn't it an advanced drill? So we are identifying a threat. We're removing obstructions. We have to problem solve. We're shooting outside in a very different position. If you haven't done that before, if you haven't shot from a seated position, the first time you do it, it's different, just like anything else. And then you have to move almost as like you're a turret, forcing your back into the rear of that seat so you can have your steady platform, so you can get your sight picture and then you can get your shots off. Pulled rear security, communicated. Now, if I had, remember, there's a lot of elements going on. Would I be announcing to my, to my bad guys that I'm reloading? No, but if we were in a partnering scenario, he could be laying out cover fire once he got out of the clean side of the vehicle while I was doing my reload. So there's a lot going on. You have to look into that drill for what it does and for who it applies to in your application. Shoot, move, communicate. Security, mobility, lower shot silhouette profile. Multiple shooting positions. Getting off the ambush X. What else can I think of that would tie that in? I want you to replay that video and look at things. I want to hear your comments and your feedback on how you do drills like that and how do you make them work. Hey, listen, come on down to Virginia Beach here. We have a private range here to our 24 by 7 access. We do night operations, uh, team drills. Uh, mainly here we do lots of private work so people come on down for the week kind of make mini vacations out of it it's really a lot of fun and uh we'll show you a good time down here in virginia beach we'll talk to you soon i look forward to seeing you all right ciao